So one misconception is that if you find an image uh, on Google Images that it's automatically royalty free and there's no copyright infringement, but that's actually not the case. Uh, the images that pull up on uh, Google, um, and I'm just let's look at an example here, type in Apple and images. So some folks might assume that these are all free to use, especially for YouTube videos or any presentations. Um, that's not necessarily the case. And so there's a way to ensure the images you use are royalty free. And that's using the Google Advanced uh, Image Search. And you can find this at google.com advanced, advanced underscore image underscore search. And so let's search for Apple. You can just use the top line here is fine. You can, you can certainly use these other uh, descriptors as well if you're trying to uh, uh, really narrow down your selection. But uh, for the purposes, the demonstration purposes, I'll just type in Apple. And then at the bottom here, you want to go to Usage Rights. And then select the, the now of course, the further you go down here, uh, the more restrictive you're going to be or your, your results will be. So if I just click on free to use or share, you'll, you'll probably, I'm sure you'll get a, quite a few images that are free to share, uh, free to use or share. And then if you go down further and further, you'll probably get fewer and fewer. So that's important to know. But uh, let's say you want to post a YouTube video, you want to use some images. Uh, I would say you can use this free to use or share, even commercially. So click on that and then advanced search. And then so now everything that's listed here is a free to use and even commercially and so you don't have to worry about any copyright infringement and if you do put in a, in a YouTube video and if you do get uh, maybe denied for monetization in the appeal you can simply tell them that you uh, pulled this image down from uh, the Google royalty free search engine and that, that, that should suffice that's worked for me in the past but um, anyway that's uh, just a little tidbit, especially if you use a lot of images, you want to make sure they're royalty free. You don't want to get any uh, copyright, copyright infringement uh, issues.